In this video, we're going to look at a method that allows you to select HTML elements by using CSS selectors. The document query selector all method returns a node list of elements within the document that matches the specified selector. So for example, if you wanted to return all of the elements with a particular class name, you give the query selector all method a string with a dot followed by the name, just like we do in a CSS file. If you wanted to return the element with a particular ID, you use a pound sign followed by the ID value. You can also just specify a tag name. So if you wanted to return all the div tags, you just specify div. In our JavaScript code, we're specifying a div tag. Since we have two div tags, both of them will be returned. In this example, we have HTML code for a page with two articles. Each article is contained within a div tag. When the button is clicked, both articles will be highlighted. So let's look at how this works. When the button is clicked, the highlight items function is called. Then the query selector all method finds all the div tags. The resulting node list is stored in this variable. Afterward, we use the node list for each method to iterate over each element in the node list, which are the div tags, and set their background color to yellow. Let's try it out. And that's how you use the document query selector all method in JavaScript. I hope you found it helpful. Thanks for watching and please subscribe and leave a comment.